just just to get off. He was talking about the trading card market and stuff like that. And the Pokemon, he bought, bought some Pokemon cards for like, I yeah, think, that's sick, with. Bae. 200 grand, bro. Like I was saying earlier, like, and for over a year, two years now, like, trading cards have been going up. The market has been going up for trading cards. Basketball specifically, but, like, Pokemon cards also have been going up. Yeah, it don't make no sense still, eh? I mean, that's, that's on you. Yeah, I don't understand the Pokemon cards going up. I think it's just a commodity type of situation. It's like, why does um, live hogs go up? Like, what, the, why does water go up? Why does these other things go up? Live hogs. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking That's about... That's something from the Bay of Fundy. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> live hey, hogs. Live, live, no, like, live hogs the crossing. Market, you could buy... <laughs> they have, like, a... Bun- they, you could buy, like, live hogs as a commodity. I oh, just, like, oh. Yeah. oh, you mean, like, pigs? Yeah. You, you could uh, buy it as a commodity. Mm. Just, like, barrels of oil. All that yeah. is, like, commodities that you could buy. Mm. So, I, 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 it's just, like, a commodity that... that has the mind supply basically, but I see necessity in them things, but I don't see necessity in Pokemon cards. Like, I don't I know, agree. it literally is a piece of paper, baby. And how much you paid 200,000? This yeah. for box, yeah, I don't know how much cards he got. Oh, it's a box of cards. He got like, I think he's got like a couple boxes of like a lot of what cards. is he gonna do with them? Look at them. I don't know. I think he's just keeping them for collector's items. Holographic Charizard. <laughs> <laughs> I choose you. <laughs> I don't think he's playing with it, but I honestly think he's gonna have them sitting probably, bro. Logic is is do some weird things to me, bro. Yeah, he is he's weird. He's weird. He's, he's a weird. weird character. Yeah, I can even say be all talking about my boy, but no, I, <laughs> I mean, I mean, he, what he was talking about in the post is nostalgia, also, and he, he I think he's also talking about from the investing side, cause like I say, they've been going up. Shit, they've been going up, bro. I wouldn't, I wouldn't spend fifty dollars on a Pokemon guy in Derby. <laughs> But like I told you, the exa- example of Luka Doncic card, I don't know the stats on Pokemon, but I use Luka Doncic. I think like a year ago he was selling for fifty. I think if you go on eBay now, they are three fifty four hundred dollars for the for the rookie card. Yeah, I think all of them is stupid, bro. Yes, yeah, okay. it's, it's a weird. I don't know. This is a collector's item type of deal, but I don't know. Yeah, yeah, but some I collectors know, items that have value in other things. Like okay, you buy a coin. It's gold or something like that. It's a 19-something yellow coin or whatever. I can see buying that. It makes sense. But uh, it's a piece of paper, bro. <laughs> but, like, okay, let's look something at... something printed Let's look it. at... I, yeah. guess, I guess this is slightly <laughs> different, but I'll use the example of, like, uh, N64 Mario Kart game that is uh, that is sealed still. Yeah, but that have value, too. Yeah, I know, but I'm saying the... the That's like buying the sticker from off the box for... Yeah, the for reason that it has value <laughs> is because it's a... It's an old relic of... But even a sticker of value, you could put it on something. What you could do with that card? The oldness and the relicness of it is the, the value, bro. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. You, you can't even put that up on your wall and say, this. look at this on, on my with wall. With the Pokemon, Pokemon trading card. card. You could. You could, because what I've heard is a story about this 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 guy who has a room of car, of trading cards that he has, all of Magic Johnson and thing. I forgot how much the room worth. Of the cards is a high fucking amount. Mm. I think it's in the millions, if I remember correctly. My y'all didn't go to my card room then. <laughs> <laughs> he, had, he had it like a wine cellar type go, of situation. I need to go bro. in my uh, attic and go find the blue eyes white dragon <laughs> and thing. <laughs> sell it to Logic for three three hundred thousand. <laughs> yeah, but even like like I forgot what it was. I think it was either you know, I heard the story from. I forgot who I heard the story from, but basically. Even um, uh, you know, baseball games like they used to have like the schedules, the game program, the program game of it, like on paper. They used to have like, oh, what is happening or whatever in the New York Yankee Stadium. Days even go. Initially, there was some cents. I think one of them was worth like thousands, like two thousand, three thousand dollars, just from like the seventies. Wow. Mm. So like that's what I'm trying to say. All that is like, I guess just to oldness of it and, and the fact that it's limited and, and it's availability that driving prices up, bro. That's all. That's how I look at it, at least. I don't know. Yeah, Same man. as, like, plush toys. Like, plush toys be selling, bro. They just be going up. Yeah, they... they I mean, like, if I if I, if I I was to start a gaming room, I'd, I'd get stuff like that to put in it. 
yeah the plush toys and, and all that stuff is go the up bobbleheads and all that stuff yeah if you had a little gaming room or something you gotta make it look good don't say after that me i know if you get in the game room it just could be the room and the chair I mean, yeah. it, I definitely it, would do the same thing as what you're saying. Like a gaming room, like a gaming room, play like your games or whatever. Mm-hmm. That, that would not be your front room. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you can't put that stuff out in your front room, mate. Eh? You could. It's, it's, it's your house. I mean, the, the I never thing, picture. Never allow that, bro. You never know. Me personally, I ne- sorry to cut you. I never, I never picture a gaming room. I don't think, I don't think I have. A, I love a gaming room. I mean, I have like a studio room, like with one DJ but setup or whatever. Yeah. Uh, so in that yeah, example, it'll be in there. It could be in there, yeah. It'd be like a studio. No, but room. that's what it's, that's what I think he's liking it to. If it's your gaming room, if it's your office, if it's man cave, y- yeah, yeah, yeah. That type of situation. You have the collectibles in there, yeah. Put on the like you got like a platinum plaque from somebody from a gunner when I put it in the trash. <laughs> <laughs> I put it in the trash. <laughs> 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 I spent I spent twenty thousand dollars on this gunner plaque. <laughs> It belongs in the trash. <laughs> Symbolizing <laughs> symbolism. Just put it on the side of the trash. It's like remembering. Like, <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. I know. I, 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 I could. You, you could do more research to figure out. Obviously, there's more to it than what I'm saying or what any of us are saying. Really, it's probably something to it that why over time it's still going up and fluctuating. You know what I mean? Yeah, because it's definitely they- more to what we're saying, but. And they still making Pokemon cards too. That's yeah. the thing. I don't know, but how so much? I don't know how like yeah, how the value can go up if they still making it. I don't know. It depends how much you're making. I can see limited stuff. I can see the value going up. Like there's only fifty in the world. This card. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Charizard, I choose you. <laughs> get in with the body box of cards, soon, bro. Look at the This he's makes going sense, bro. He's going different ventures, bro. It's <laughs> be different mindsets. I don't know what I mean. Like, <laughs> I was, I was, lo- I looked in the box of cards already for sure, for real. Is this a Lewis Hamilton F1 <laughs> autographic? He can't have a show, bro. Just Lewis the habit, Hamilton. you know. Just the habit. <laughs> yeah, man. I, I looked uh, in the box of cards before, actually, but I just didn't. I know. I don't know. I just, I don't know. That's just me personally. I don't see yeah. that. I mean, I mean hey, like see, you say, I see if you got money and you want to collect cars. Nah, I see that. Yeah. I think that's, you know, yeah. Cars? Yeah, like you want to yeah, yeah. collect cars and you could drive that shit. Like, yeah, but you're going to take this old antique out or whatever. Yeah. Or show it off. But, I mean, I guess cars could work the same way. I guess, like, it's the same thing. Like I say, the don't you, don't you example, it's 50 to 350, that's... What that's six hundred percent profit, bro. If you were to buy it at that price and mm. sell it at the three fifty, yeah, but it is, is it's speculative on his performance. Yeah. So he may not perform or not or whatever, you know. But it's a it's a chance that he may. People Just don't make sense to me. But anyway, you go. I was saying people collect a lot of things for like. Yeah, people collect a lot of weird things. A lot things of things like movies and all type of things. Yeah. Yeah, maybe y'all are saying the movies now. The movies obviously lead to it. To me, I think we talked about this a little. I don't think, I think the states likes the aspect of um, going to the movies too much. Like you I think, th- you think movies can't die. I they don't say they cannot die. I'm just saying that I think it will be reworked in today's formula or into the future. This is my assumption. I could be wrong. I just feel like there's a lot of money to be made in bringing back the theater to watch a movie. That's all I'm saying for Hollywood perspective. For you to spend $300 million on a movie and be in a limbo to not release it because you're going to lose money, I don't think they're going to just take that lightly and just say, oh, Netflix win. You know what I mean? I don't. I just don't think that's going to happen. So I, I propose or assume they're going to find a way to like in certain cities, when they have space, they'll pick up a, a bigger space to do it and actually create the movies to be a socially distanced event. Yeah. In terms yeah, of like really. being a bigger facility and actually selling tickets, like how you see plays sold, where you have tickets sold for five or four or three or two, and it's literally socially distanced in the theater and still have the surround sound pumping. I think I think they can just flicking up the price on Netflix and Hulu them and just throw it on there, bro. 
I mean, that would be a good call for the owners and stuff like that if that were to happen. But I just don't feel like Hollywood is going to give up the rights of movies that easily because initially they didn't want. What do you mean, want, bro? What do you mean by that? Like, you saying they make a movie, get in with Hollywood Netflix. Hollywood don't have nothing to do with that. What you just mentioned, I thought you just mentioned that if you giving it to Netflix, what Hollywood you just saying. Hollywood is just the area that they shoot the movies in. No, I know, but I'm just saying Warner Brothers. I w- okay, well, a big movie corp. I don't know. Screen, screen. Warner, G- Warner Brothers could give could give a movie to to to, to stream on on Netflix. They, they could. Still, they still making the movie. They could, but they, they still they, making the money. I mean, they have their own streaming service coming out though. They're working on it. Well, either way, they still making the money. Why why go to the movie theater? But that's what I'm trying to show you. I think the margins for them. I could be wrong. We love the you know the look. They don't at make it. more money from. I don't know. It depends, cause box office. I don't know what's the highest grossing movies or whatever. But when you spend in two hundred, hundred million dollars and you gross in seven hundred million dollars, I don't know how much you actually made. You know, in terms of the studio who produced the movie, but I'm pretty sure you're probably making more than if you crack a deal with Netflix. I could be wrong, but I mean, I don't why know. would you pay? I so. We can't talk with a normal person or a common, I guess. But would you go on Netflix and pay five more dollars, or hypothetically three more dollars, to watch this movie or watch a movie? Why would I spend three more dollars if it's not coming on your on your monthly thing? Oh, so you saying it's a separate charge to watch these movies? Maybe because like Mulan, like I was telling you all, when they released it was, Mulan, it was twenty dollars to watch it. It was thirty one. On it. And own it. I think it's thirty. But you could watch it now uh, for free or on there. Oh, okay. For just for just watching using the streaming service. Oh. Well I know. I just don't think I just think I could be wrong. I just think they may have more margins in the box office term. And I agree, movies are going but streamlined they, to services, but they they was going extinct too bef- before before COVID happened. It yeah. almost going to movies like that. Only, yeah. only like the big, big, big movies was getting. A lot of the theaters was going under. Yeah, because they only just make money. Theaters only just make money from concessions. They don't make. Yeah. They don't make money from the movie at all. Yeah, they only just make money. That's why their concessions is be so high. You go buy a popcorn and yeah. a soda, it costs you eighteen dollars. Yeah, the margins are in the the stuff they sell. And I agree. So, if anyone coming. Like that only at the big blockbusters. They wasn't making no money, so they couldn't like they was they was going under, so they couldn't keep up with the bills and shit. Yeah, I mean I know, I know. We got to see. I think that's what they'll do. I just think the nostalgia of going to the movies is big in American culture. I it it could go. I think nothing not sell out in the movie sense, like in Avengers. Yeah. Ain't nothing been that big since then, bro. That's been like two years now. Yeah. I don't know, babe. I don't know. I I agree with you. I don't think like I don't think people are gonna move away from the movies right, right, quick, quick, quick. Cause it's the experience different. Like it ain't like you like you in your house compared to you in the movie theater is a whole I different agree. experience. So I agree with that. Yeah. Experience different. I don't know. It's like I don't know. Like like you say, I agree. The movie theaters probably they they make zero from the movie because they have to pay to even play that movie. Yeah, they have to pay whoever to get the rights to play that movie in a large format yeah. or whatever. Yeah. So they so may even reimagine that whole process and make it yeah it's maybe gotta, easier for the theater and change rates and change the stuff to go against streaming. They may change the whole makeup of the whole industry, bro. Because if you keep it at that level, streaming. Go, Slowly take market market share and keep on, yeah, taking away, bro. They might do with both y'all saying, bro. Maybe they may go. What they streaming. may do is make their own streaming, like what Warner Brothers and yeah. all these other production companies doing. They create their own streaming service, and you, depending on who it is, if it's the Screen Gems or if it's this and that, but that's a lot of streaming services. Because like I was telling y'all, the average streaming service they saying that normal people will have before pandemic was three. So it's like you yeah. ain't got one. Get a streaming service from every studio who create movies. You know what I mean? All that can cost is pirating, but I mean that's true. It, I see movies getting a little harder to see on pirating sites now. I think. I agree. I think they getting a little hot. I don't know. Even Netflix originals. Yeah, it's getting harder to. 
I mean, you probably could find it. I, we're not saying go find it. <laughs> but Do y'all, it's pirating. No, <laughs> oh, yeah, it's pay for everything, baby. It's pay for everything too, baby. Dab it, popcorn dime, baby. <laughs> sick. <laughs> Arr. <laughs> <laughs> He's sick, baby. He's sick, baby. That's a robot, man. Oh, boy. No, but I mean, <laughs> I know. It but could, I think it could be both. I, I think they, I think they could do both because they're gonna try to capture. Because people don't care, they want to stream in the house, and people won't go to the movies. It's two different type of people in the world, I think. Yeah, but honestly though, it's a lot of subset too. Because honestly, I would rather stay home. But some movies I want to watch in the movies. For yeah, real. like so it's it's like like movies that you think could be garbage. You you would stream that. Yeah, you wouldn't say, but I ain't gonna go all my way to go out there and watch this. And I think this is gonna be garbage. Yeah, that's just. That's a win-win for them, I think. I know. I I'm interested to see what what gonna be the solution. I will see. I just feel like I mean, the, the, but the problem with my potential idea is that I don't know if it's the states in general, but I think a lot of positions in the states, I think line is a problem already. Before we even talk about them building these infrastructures that are gonna be bigger facilities. You know what I mean? Like New yeah. York, for example. Where you going to have a huge music... I'm mean, not music. Where you going to have a huge movie facility that is close enough? Because I think people would drive 30, 40 minutes to go to the movies. I don't think they need to make it bigger, you know. They they could keep with the social distancing. And, like, if if they in cahoots together, like you say, and the rates get lower, they'd still be profitable. Like if they, Yeah. I don't think they need to expire. They, if they get they in cahoots... Do boots. Boots. Yeah, or re or remodel it. Yeah, or I yeah. guess. Yeah, I don't think you could start with remodeling. I guess it, that's gonna be probably. A but lot. I was thinking like more. I was thinking obviously yeah, remodeling too. But I was also thinking like if you potentially were to bring the new movie, yeah, like the new you know, the new way to to do movies yeah. to like the future of of movies or whatever you know. But or they yeah. can bring back uh in your car movies. Yeah, that's another thing. Oh, and yeah. I was thinking if they do that, it would have to be something to where you could, I don't know if this is a thing yet, but most cars are Bluetooth, so maybe you could find a way to hook up the Bluetooth as a proximity thing and you could hook up the Bluetooth yeah. with the audio from the movie. Probably yeah, possible, but right? I, but I think it would be better for them to still stick with their own speakers because, like, what if your car Bluetooth um, or your car, don't have Bluetooth or your car speakers ain't that good? Yeah, I mean, I get so I that. I think it would be better to just stick stick with your... Yeah, yeah I mean, if you offer it as a choice, you still have it there, mm-hmm. but you offer yeah. it as a choice. Yeah, so. I mean, and they can probably provide their own part of those speakers for you, too. Probably, mm-hmm. I don't know. Hook it when you're that's, that's what they used <laughs> to do back in the day. That's what they they used to give, give you a speaker and put it on, on your door. Oh, oh and okay. Put it inside your car. I never do driving. Yeah, I never. I never do it either. I, I just one see around it on TV. Oh, it's oh, one, it's one around there? I think it's one around here. Oh, I never do it. Kadeem, <laughs> Kadeem, you. <laughs> <laughs> I see Kadeem's look and I was like, oh. Why do y'all do about to do that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> <Not me. laughs> <laughs> you know you're going to go golf soon. <laughs> Tiger Woods. <laughs> Animals. <laughs> <laughs> that uh, into a nut, bro. Oh my god! <laughs> but nobody like the, the world gonna change, dog. Cause I I don't know how true it is. I didn't look at myself, but my coworker told me that this just along the lines of people working together. Like how y'all talking about potentially movies working up with like cinemas together, whatever. I heard that Microsoft now is working with GameStop. They like they working. They I don't know how to, how would the with the um, camaraderie could be, but. They work with GameStop now, like in like a contract or contractual agreement. I haven't the looked at my like, I don't know. I don't know what the plan but this is. This is what we was talking about weeks exactly, ago. Exactly. Exactly. We mentioned it's like digital is gonna be it. If GameStop were to go digital, yeah. How would they do it? Yeah. That's, that's forcing your hand, though. You can't. That digital, physical. I ain't like that too much. But that's what, what it's you gonna talking be. about. Forcing your hand. Forcing your hand. You have to get digital. You have to. You have to get. To do the price that they offering you, you can't get that second market shit no more. Very less is away. They you may know, just offer both. No, how you could? That's but well, that's what they do now. I know, but I mean, I I just don't understand. 
it has to be something else too. Them, like GameStop don't have leverage on Microsoft unless it's a is it a is it an acquisition or is it? I don't know. I didn't look it up. I just heard he just this word of mouth now. It's this all word of mouth. It was something guys. we talked about on the pod a long time ago too. That was like, but GameStop um new plan is for two. Right? We yeah, was exactly. no, we were saying that GameStop have to start um creating. I forgot. You're saying GameStop is gonna be the new blockbuster or something? Yeah. If they didn't, yeah, if that's they it. didn't, if they didn't advance, yeah, they, and that's yeah. what we were saying. We were saying that what what was the thing you call Avia or whatever? The, what what the thing called? That is two streaming games. You say Google have? Oh, oh. Um, thing um, I know that dude. Stadia. Stadia. Yeah. yeah, if it, if if they don't do their own, create their own branch of gaming or whatever, and have their own rights to games, there's no need for Sony developers or Microsoft developers to go in GameStop or yeah. be sold in GameStop. There's no no need. Yeah. That's how I think too. Next four years, five years, they may have digital consoles, but next time it just be one console to be digital. <laughs> That's what I think. Count the money, stack it up to the roof. Balenciaga on me, cause I make the money move. They always talking big, but when they see me, they say, This ain't designer. Die designed it. Pop out, we slide it. They out to find us. This ain't designer. Die designed it. Swerving, we nauseous. You blessed to watch it. Gold up in my mouth, finally cap the chain. Sliding with the gang, you can never hang with. Careful how you staring, all these men's is dangerous. And the feds ask the questions, I ain't never saying shit. Switch up how to tell them I'm a rapper, not a felon. I got models in the kitchen, about to bust down. Switch up how to Probably. It's gonna be a digital. It's gonna be one console. I agree. Digital. I mean, and there's another it situation probably, as too. Right they already backwards compatible and all this stuff now. Yeah. They say 99% of the PlayStation 4 games could be able to be played on PS5. So just all that gonna be that. So you straight that next on. gen. <laughs> 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 but y'all are gonna only get a PS5, baby. That's only that's only four FIFA's, baby. Kadeem, Kadeem might get that too. You know that that shipment come down from Mountain. <laughs> I good. Well, I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Need, need birthday next year. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Hey, Merry Christmas. Oh, I think yeah, Christmas coming up too. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, bro. But ha- happy Hanukkah. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, what the uh, black like, one is? Oh, up. Flick. You know, can you don't go over Christmas? You can eat Christmas dinner. Can we? Yeah, yeah, let, let me stop. Catch. Let me. <laughs> He ain't going home for Christmas, <laughs> so you know he eating up there. <laughs> Christmas, Christmas with the dinner, kings. Boy. I don't know what you're talking Christmas about, Christmas with boy. the kings. This is dinner, boy. But he can, he can post his own video. <laughs> it ain't going to be 12 days of Christmas. <laughs> 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 Let's not get started on your YouTube channel. Let me get us, please. But, oh, man. Um, 
Yeah, if, if if it going more digital, bro, I guess that's another thing where could potentially hike up prices for physical things and physical copies. Yeah, of that would do that in all those realms because it's digital now, bro. So you have it, you know. I think games too much now, but anyway, I agree. Another. If they right. go digital, they could put them on like a flash drive or something. You mean like past games? Mm. Or maybe maybe you go into uh, like. You go. You carry. You carry your hard. Like you know, you, they have like the little flash drive, hard drives. You could get second market digital copies, Masi. Like with, I don't. I guess they'll have like less content on it than the for than the original. You won't have the access codes to get into this or that. You know what I mean? Mm. I mean, I guess. But so I mean, you go they would stop giving all. Up, so let's look at an old, an old digital game, right? Like FIFA 18. If they had the old FIFA 18 on digital. I guess you spend less on it, and it don't have no updates or nothing. Yeah. So I guess it just be a smaller size, as you're saying, basically. Yeah, you just go, you carry carry in a portable hard drive or a portable SSD. You go with the GameStop, you give them it, they plug it in, they put on, they they upload the game onto it, and you just ride out. That's I guess. That's the only other way. That's the, you still at the end of the day. That's still slightly physical. Yeah. But you like that's the only way if they remove the CD CD drive. Yeah. I honestly, I've been saying games been too much, bro. Yeah, games too much. been steadily going up. They yeah, going for up PS4, now, I was like, once I see PS4, stop price going. I say, wait, this don't mean, this is not good. But games used to be $34, bro. Real talk. $34, bro. Yeah. And I saw 70 You better talk money, $100. It needs to be a lot, you know, bro. Two games was $100 in Nassau. And 64 games used to be expensive, too. You only could have gone to what the place called? Nassau Cards and Games? Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) They had the lock. You go in there? Yes, boy. How much much for the Magic Kazooie? Or only 120. (laughs) (laughs) What? (laughs) (laughs) Only. Yeah, (laughs) man. I go to the States, get us for for 50, bro. 40. (laughs) 20, 30 dollars, bro. I remember yeah. one time I sent my old man for something. He bring that, that game back. He's like, never again. So you don't ask for nothing for the rest of the year, bro. <laughs> 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 I say, what a sick. Yeah, but games roughing. Their games roughing now, so be. Unless you go to retro games. Yeah, I was just going to say. I was going to check out retro games, man. 242, you see what I'm saying? You say he the battery, we call him Elon Musk. <laughs> 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 yeah, man. But yeah, um, wait, dog. All the, all the, all the, I know how what happened to reselling of games into this new wave of digital. I don't know. I think digital stuff, good sales will get us though. Like I think at some points in the year, them sales would be nice for digital. No, they do because a lot of the time, days be free. Yeah, it's really a like, lot of PSN games when they when the year come up, when it's off season, days be either free or there's dip in price and then go back up. I can tell you one thing: if I get a PlayStation Five. I just downloaded getting. P- yep. I just downloaded PSN games. Straight up. I can't avoid no oh. hundred dollar game. Yeah, it's a hundred now, right? For PS five games. Well it, it could be a hundred in Canada, but it could be I think it's like eighty and an American. Hundred dollars is crazy. Get us could be pulling. No so yeah, on branches and so hard. <laughs> <laughs> what I need to do. Is just buy up a bunch of games on this generation at seventy dollars. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't think they're gonna. Con- I, I, I don't think I don't they're gonna continue doing it. that though. They can't do that for too too long. Yeah, but at least you love like a year's where you save up and buy another game. I guess. I that, guess. I don't see the next gen thing and work for real. That cutting out, but to me that that cutting out the amount of games that you could you could buy. So like, let's say you might have could scratch up a little extra. Forty dollars to make that one that one sixty for the two games, but yeah. now you at one hundred dollars, you can't get that extra game. So some some of the some of the game people can lose. Or you could take some games to to trade in that you have physical <laughs> copy, <laughs> and, you know, try to get that price down. Still, still get it for eighty dollars. Because what may happen too, we'll be talking about is taking in your thing of if game stuff still survives. What you could potentially maybe do is upload. If you want to sell the game, upload your digital copy to the PSN network, and they may put redeemable points on your on your account. Mm. And instead of like giving True. you the redeemable that, points, that they could do that. They'll give you the redeemable points, and the redeemable points could be like let's say five points for a dollar, or tw- you know. Yeah, could if, ju- if you, do if it you like say I I 
I cancel all my rights to this game. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and I delete it. off your hard yeah. drive. You can't. You have to. The only you can play is the rebuy. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's 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 a if like you can't do that. Then yeah, that that's 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 a, that's they a don't pay us for this shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, they don't pay us for this shit, right? That's all a right, good shit. idea, though. That's that's it maybe is. how reselling yeah. may go, bro. Probably. Yeah. That may be how reselling may go. Cause that that that's a win win for PlayStation too. For still, cause you ain't gotta see no one. They it may it, even if it take. I, I mean, over time it should be automatic. But cause let's say even if you want to rebuy that game back, they they making you the amount of points that you get for that game ain't even come close to rebuying that value. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, they they can still re they can still adjust it depending on you know what. Boy, it is, if they do that, they they win big. That's. That's that's what it'll potentially be, I think, though. I ain't not going to pick up. I, I think know. it's just doing that, but hopefully it don't pick up. Autobots. <laughs> Autobots <laughs> attack. <laughs> they said they want ARG and Pirate. <laughs> so they be locking in, oh, right? Shit. Oh, flick. <laughs> Enemy coming in in your AO. <laughs> Enemy spotted. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, hey, that would be you know that would be a good idea if they do that. Then we'll see. Yeah, it's future, right? Future yeah, be different, bro. For yeah. gaming. Yeah, everything future could be different yeah. because of this this thing. Yeah, a lot of people been saying like, oh, they can't wait till twenty twenty one. Like twenty twenty one can change shit. Yeah, I know twenty twenty one gonna change, bro. <laughs> people tripping, bro. Like, like you see, Toronto recently gone back a phase now because of you know. I think I think I was talking about this in the next group. They restricting um thingums now, so I think Baba's closing back down in Toronto. Wow, and like they going backwards. Yeah, they going backwards because I was looking at the population recently in two thousand seventeen. The downtown Toronto is two point nine million, bro. Yeah, babe. Toronto. So I was, I was saying, average like three million in that downtown Toronto alone. So I could see why, you know, this is second wave considered, in in terms of everything else. So I don't know how much waves they're saying it's supposed to be, but yeah, but this this um situation up and down for real. Real talk, babe. Hopefully yeah. these vaccines come out from mRNA. You know, I make a little profit off it too. Oh, you still got that position in? Yeah, but I can't wait for that. I hope, hope, hopefully, as if 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 it come out, trying to get come boys in, inside of trading or what you trying <laughs> to do? <laughs> no, baby, wait, be straight, dog. <laughs> if if that if that come out and not and not flop, I lose big. It's like gambling, really. I going mean, to the casino, might go to the casino, I go to the fucking casino, man. <laughs> Throw some money I on the table. I never talk with this when I was fucking <laughs> 25. <laughs> never, babe. See what I'm saying? Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, my dog. That's how it is, What's this Jen saying, though? <laughs> <laughs> Dawn one. Yeah, I was like, look at him. I was like, look at him. What this <laughs> Yeah, but I mean. I mean, but I know, bro. I mean. Covid, I don't know. Covid, I send, I, I always say this every episode. I send the fans to Covid, bro. Yeah, I think it might be fake, might be it's, real. It's just, it's like, okay, now this is coming into cold and flu season. Everybody sniffling, coughing, and stuff. Yeah, no, that's, 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 what, that's that's what could make it worse. That's that's what making it worse right now. I think for them the most, like, like but I hate, I hate, I hate like January and February is be the is be the worst time for yeah. it. Yeah. So around then. That's when that's when COVID did actually really 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 pick up yeah. around that time. So now nah, when we hit that time again, that could be the real second wave. Yeah. Yeah. Dog, that's you that's real flu season. You could just assume that you have something, and if it's if it's either bacterial or viral, you know, you just gotta. I mean, if you have a common goal, you can't. I I guess you have to just assume that. I'm guessing like if you have a common goal, they can say 14 days still or what. Cause I mean, you can't yeah. just not expect that you're not gonna get sick ever again. Yeah, you know exactly. what I mean. So like, you just gotta assume that it's another viral flu, but not the not the COVID, not the Rona. I wanna know if the COVID test. I wanna know if that's like specific, specific. I don't Maybe know. I think they tested for antibodies. Cause, cause isn't like COVID like a mutation of a flu anyway, a flu virus or whatever. Like, so is that specific, specific to 
I think to test for it, I think I forgot what they're using, but they're using some breakdown of it to find in your bloodstream to see if it's active or not or something like that. Oh, okay. If it's active, you need the 14 days. If you had the antibodies, I mean, you had it already and you fended it off without knowing yeah. and that already has passed because I think it's a shedding period. If it's in the shedding state, that's when you have to go for 14 days. When you out of shed shedding, that's when you had antibodies for it and you already dealt with it. From my knowledge, I has, any, has any new uh, material come out to say if if it's only once and done or? I don't know, I don't know. I don't know how yeah, the antibody situation work. Cause I think if you have antibodies for something, you still could get it. It's just that your body is more able to fend it off because you already dealt with it. Yeah, well, that's what antibodies is. But like, th it won't it won't ever escalate to the point where you feel it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Man. I know. It's a lot. I don't know. Still a little weird for me, man. I mean, people have died, so it must be real. Yeah. But I mean, I did an average of the Canadian cases again. It's at two point seven percent of like death COVID. compared to infected. Yeah. But I mean, That's the Ontario high. numbers That's still, still jump. Regular flu. Yeah, Ontario numbers jumped because I think within a week it jumped up like. It was either 800 or something like that. I don't remember. See the but in this last week, because Ontario, like, this is why they locked down more. Because of, of the recent numbers in the last week. It's rough, but yeah, it's rough, but yeah. This lockdown is affect people economically a lot, bro. Like. Yeah. Economical, mentally. Yeah. It's just rough, but if you could have one wish, it would just be to go back to the way things was, so you could just go out and have a go out and party and really? you know just socialize normally. Just one little glimpse of, but you can't even have Christmas party no more, bro. That's a vibe. Hey, that that hating a lot of people, bro. That's no a vibe. Christmas party. Yeah, I think I'm making home Christmas for real, but. Yeah. It don't really make sense. You can't just, really see no one like that. It's just chancy, but I don't know. Yeah. Chancy. Yeah, man. I don't know. Hopefully, man. We keep praying, man. We keep praying. Everybody stay in good positive vibes. MRNA you know? coming with that, though. Say we what? We, we coming with that the MRNA. Vaccine. The vaccine. Oh, oh. Little vaccine, little thing, thing. This boy sound like he on the board <laughs> of directors, <laughs> you know, right? <laughs> I remember, but like, it, remember they was like, "Oh, but the vaccine coming in months, months, and now nah, I ain't nothing." No, they they say when when it when it drop. If if this phase last phase work, it's gonna be around January, February. So then phase three now or phase mm. four? Mm. Then last phase. Oh. Wow. So January, February, but that's still it's still it's still ain't gonna be normal even after the if the vaccine working and and it out because you still have the the cost of it could be probably high. And then people, the, the the people ain't enough be able to take it like that all right off the bat. Because the government, like governments can be paying for it. You still have to pay for that yourself. And then it yeah. ain't going to be readily available like that. Yeah. But once production start, it get, it could slowly, slowly, it ain't going to ever get fully back to normal. But it can so, slowly get back there and we can be able to. Slight socialize and make more. So hopefully. Yeah. I mean, hopefully that's... If it all that's work out. Right? Honestly, way, I just think... I just trying to familiarize myself with this. I think this could just be what it is, but it could be, like, something that's, like, suggested, highly suggested and highly recommended, but I don't think it'll be mandated. Like, mask and everything else. Yeah. Do you think that this will reduce the Earth's population, though? Like, with less socialization going on, do you think it's less chances of people going out and having more children and redu reduces the Earth population? I don't know. Of it humans, affects a least. lot of things, bro, because, like, if you look at it macro, I feel like, obviously, I think humans in general are interacting type of people, right? So you do less of the things that help you to get out of the mindset of thinking, overthinking things, or doing things that are... Um, negative to your health and er, all of that, I think it's going to affect the masses probably in a negative way because of you don't have an outlet anymore. You just 
home with your own thoughts. You know what I mean? So it's like it's rough on um, each person by itself. But in terms of the population, I don't know. Because like, like we're saying, I've only seen around 3% mostly from when I do the calculation of the numbers I see from no, other I countries. No, I ain't talking about deaths, you know. I'm talking about like socializing, like uh, as in as in the cotton phase. Like you think people Say are going less out. Less grinding. Yeah, like less, <laughs> less. Like less grind if you <laughs> come home though. That's all I don't get. Multiple, like you, you, how, you're not meeting as much people anymore. Uh, I don't know. I mean, in the long term, guess you may be on to something now. If this is l- like this is long term as we see it Maybe now. Maybe birth rate going to drop down. That's your yeah. thing. Yeah. Yeah. Because even the people who uh people who like, I, I wouldn't, I don't want to say it like this, but more intelligent beings, <laughs> they'll be like, uh, I won't have more. I won't have more children because it's like economy stress right now. Yeah, too. like it could be like a lot yeah. of stress on me. Like I, that's a that's a way to look at it, but it could. But I think it will. I think how you talking? I never thought about it, but it probably will go down. Do yeah, I, I mean, from our perspective, maybe the birth the birth rate at least would drop probably. Yeah, and I guess in turn would lead to decrease in population. So maybe this was the Earth's plan all along. But a lot of people Sen- say, you know, being. <laughs> Mother Earth, I don't know. Terra. <laughs> I don't know these. I don't know these. <laughs> these, these nicknames. No, right? he, he talk, <laughs> just talk about about all that alien. Like, no, Terra. Terra is the Latin name for Earth. Oh, I oh, I, I didn't know. I thought you were talking about. <laughs> sen- I was meaning sentient beings type of situation. I didn't know the Terra thing. But mm. well, I don't know, bro. <laughs> I mean, that's a good point, but, but yeah. I don't know. That's like a long-term fact. I mean, yeah, you know, it's like, you know, when you have too much of something, it is a reaction for every thing. I mean, to be honest, humans cause it, so it's like it basically, us cause this, this is basically to reduce the population, which is crazy, man. Yeah, I, yeah I, I think the the population was decreasing, though. I didn't. Oh, we were still going up. Prior prior to COVID, I know. I wasn't. I wasn't keeping up with that. Mm. As far as I can see, the population is increasing. I see all baby pics on my Instagram. Oh, yeah, I tell ya. <laughs> Everyone have a baby. Increasing, bro. Increasing. Increasing. Real dark. Let me see. Uh, world population. That's too much research. <laughs> <for right now. laughs> yeah, and that ain't gonna be. Um, that ain't gonna be, you know, good anyway. Like, it ain't, gonna, it ain't gonna help you. You mean the wor- you was trying to look at the world birth rate? Yeah, but prior prior to uh, thing. Um, yeah, I mean that ain't you ain't gonna have enough information anyway. That ain't gonna be. Mm. Yeah. But yeah, good insights you already have from Gillis initially, <laughs> you know. The future is yours. When the birth. That's <laughs> 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 not like a sick movie, right? <laughs> from like the island or something. You, are, you all watch it before, right? No. Um, no I was the island. Island is like, um, they basically, uh, it's like, uh, what's the thing I'm called? When you have genetic mutation and you like do a copy of yourself. Like clones? Yeah, you have a clone ah, of yourself okay. living on this island. I mean the real person, the tethered. Oh, yeah. oh, oh! I know what you're talking about yeah, now. Yeah. Um, I forget who was in that. I forgot the actor's name too. Uh, but they 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 were just like harvest, harvest. Yeah, they, basically that's all yeah. they were. They were like. Wasn't Will Smith in that? No, it was um. I forgot the woman named Dread. She had a couple of little decent movies, but that movie was actually. Sandra good. Bullock. No. no. I don't remember. I, I think it was I the girl from Thingam, from Avengers. The gal who's the widow or whatever. Oh. oh. I think that's all. I, I could be wrong. It might, it might be. It might be. But I, I, I know what you're talking about. Because, like, I remember, like, the, the clones used to be in, like, silver suits or yeah, something like that. Yeah, they used to like be that. in white suits. And, and when they, how they made it seem. And then and the clones, clones were, um, they, they, they revolt. Yeah. I, no, well, two of them did. And when they were needed from the real person, if something happened to them, they used to say, oh, you won the lottery. And they would say, you're going to the island. Yeah. So he was actually getting killed. And get yeah, your, I, I your organ I slightly state. remember that movie. Yeah, it's a good, it's a decent concept. But yeah, that's just all that remind me of when he did that. They used to do that with pigs. 
You mean have clones and stuff? No, they grow organs and things and bakes for humans. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, we'll end it there. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> what I mean, Check bro. out next week. <laughs> for, uh, would, what would, I mean. would you put a, a pig, a pig <laughs> hog in your body? Would you buy live hogs on the on the stock market? <laughs> <laughs> the power is yours. <laughs> <laughs> Take us out around the time. We we we'll we'll for sure probably. What I mean? We keep it this way. No, you said that's at least two hours. They're keeping this one. Oh. What are we doing, man? You got the bubbly ready. Yeah, man. It's over, bro. It's over. <laughs> Let me stop because this is what we say last week. Because you could be doing this, man. <laughs> game 7. You could be doing that to Game 7, bro. All you see is Brown tonight. Just no one matches us. Put Game 6. Let's go to the ring.